day 13. Happy Sunday. It is officially 6.53 in the morning. I didn't go to bed till after 2. I'm addicted to this game. Guys, let me tell you, I'm addicted to this game. I'm going to feed that. I have to go feed my neighbor's fish. I forgot I had left her key in my pants. Um, so, yep, this is the 13th day of my um, squat challenge for American Cancer Society. And let me write this down. So, ooh. So that's 600. After that, I have done 650 squats for the month. And come here, panda girl. Go over that way, panda. <laughs> my girl's in my way. Boop. I do this boop on the butt shaboo. So I hope you guys are having a good morning. I'm going to go walking. It looks very dark outside. Um, I think, like I said, I didn't go to bed till after two. So, but. I am not a morning person, and, ooh, but, let me get to squatting, so don't mind me if I'm having brain farts in the morning, I'm just not a morning person, so, here we go, one, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. Girl, that dog farted again. Lord, that's how long this bulldog's rolled out like you. Always farting. It's like having a husband. So they snore and they fart just like a husband that I don't have. So, oh gosh. Sorry, guys, if I guess. <coughs> oh, God, excuse me. Um, yeah, today's anniversary of... <sighs> I know he would have been my soulmate. Ooh. It's been eight years. I can't... Oh, seven years, I'm sorry. Because <sighs> I, I was so excited. I bought my car. And, and I wanted to, you know, share it with him. And he was nowhere to be found. So I googled his name and it was his obituary. It was like hit, being hit with a Mack truck standing on a highway. Like it just hit me so hard. So I was not liking this time of year. I still am. I'm still not. So you know when you get that good vibe with a person and you bond with them. And I mean, I've dated. I don't know how many guys since my ex husband and I separated. But you know, you know one is the one. And especially when you meet twice, you know, within six months of each other, and you just, you just click, you just know it. Even my first meeting, you know, he was a jerk. I knew it was him, so. Rest in peace, Rome. I hope you're at peace, because when he was on Earth, he was not at peace. So, let's get number two done, guys. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ooh, that's two. Hey, squirrely face. <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah, gotta love my dog. She's doing much better. The stitches are healing, they're scattering. So, in another week, I got to instead of taking her to get an actual just get looked at, her stitches looked at, I get to send the picture to the vet. And if they see, you know, ask me to bring her in. But yeah, she's she's doing good, she's still my hemorrhoid, huh? Panda, huh? Tell me, I can't do nothing, and I'm in the house, she's. Connected at my hip or my butt. That's why I nicknamed her hemorrhoid. So I hope everybody's getting their fitness on. Seriously, guys, get up, do something. Do 100 jumping jacks. Do 100 wall push-ups. Do 100 squats. To me, I like to do 50, 10, 10 at a time with my knees. 
and you know, you guys see I'm so top heavy. And those chicks, I just don't understand how you don't physically look in them. Like when I look in, in my camera, you guys, I just feel disgusting. Like I never had this, I never had this when I was in high school and it's just, and then, you know, I know a lot of you ladies will relate to this, but remember back then when you were in high school and as a teenager, you thought, oh, I'm so fat. Now that you're a bit, if you're not the same, of course, you gain a few pounds. You wish you were back then. That's the way I feel. So, yep. Yeah. Let me get number three done. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ooh. Yeah. It is so warm in this apartment. It is very warm. Yesterday I had the AC on. Uh, uh, December. But if you live in this apartment, sometimes it feels, even my boys, my twins, they, I remember the one time, the first time my, son, my twins did this, it was around Christmas time. And, no, actually it was in January, guys. I heard something kick on. And because it's already cold, and I don't put the heat on, and the AC was on. <laughs> yes, my boys get hot too, so they're just like their mama. So, oh, I hope you guys really, really get your fitness on. I'm really am. I employ you, even though the, the gyms are closed here too, so my boys can't work out for football, but they have a full body workout they do at home, so they're even working out. So. Yes, let's get the fourth one. I know the light in the back. So making it a little hazy because I had a viewer say that's when I told y'all that you would send me that. But it's the lighting. Yeah. What is it? I'm just doing squats anyway. You don't need to play my face. So let's get down to the fourth one. I do feel strong. I feel like the muscles are on my thighs and my, my I feel like my butt butt's getting a little bit bigger. I've had a big butt boot back in the day, guys. So, I don't know if I, I, I don't, I know I told this story before, but when I was in high school, I had a stalker, but I didn't know about him. He had a crush on me too. He was my high school, he was, I was his high school crush. And we went to the senior week together after graduation, but it was 20 years later, he told me that, uh, he used to stalk me in the hallways. He said, you didn't use, you didn't feel me staring at you from behind? I said, no, you know, I didn't care. I was like, I don't know. I, I know a lot of times I walk with my ex-boyfriend in high school and I didn't pay anybody any mind. But yeah, I know I had my my um best friend who passed away. He would walk in the hallways with us too. So it was like guys there. So it was like I didn't pay attention. But after he told me that, I, I don't know, I mean, maybe a year or so after that he died. So yeah, I had a few classmates that died way before I was 40. So all right. My hemorrhoids right here. Let's get this fourth one done. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. How many you how many boyfriends or girlfriends you guys had in high school? I only had two. And first one was a basketball player. He was six six four, but he used his gay friend to break up with me. And knocked his gay friend. I kicked his gay friend in the nuts too, because I said, send this message to him. I had nothing against gay. He was a sweetheart. But I was mad. You don't break up with a girlfriend who's your gay friend. That's so wrong. I was so mad. Yeah, I wasn't a bully. You know, as a female, you get mad. Because he was, he's six four. was a man enough to tell me that he broke up with me. And he was against our, one of our rivals anyway, so. I actually seen him, hmm, at least 30 years later, working at the same warehouse I was. Yeah, it was the weirdest, it was the weirdest moment. And then, I've talked to the other one on our, we're Facebook friends. We, 
he would he sometimes come through here i know what he wanted he wanted me up for lunch but yeah we were after we broke up we were more like fwbs friends with benefits but no nah, he's a married man and he was having issues with his wife so he thought oh wow but why not play around but i don't allow people to do that i think it's a sin very sinful from anybody to cheat on their spouses so let's get the fifth one done guys i want to get to walking Whew. so here we go one two three four five six seven eight nine ten Yay! So that's 650 down, guys. And I had a goal. Oh, well, they wanted me to do 1,550. So I have 900 more to go, guys. So, um, yeah. I'm warm. I'm hot. But then again, I just did 50 squats. So I'm about to go take my walk. You guys have an awesome day. Thank you for my new viewers for subscribing. Uh, it's been a long way to get this far. But I love all my viewers, and if they recommend somebody to go subscribe to and watch, I do. So, yes, have a great day, guys. I'm about to go do my walking. I'll see you soon.